So, ah, uh, da, 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 da. not today. This is why I brought a bow. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to N Nation Craft. Yes, <laughs> Nomadic Adventures Nation Craft. Both Minecraft series on my channel, both start with ends. Wasn't a good idea. But this is the Sleeping Dragging Taylor Forge. If you haven't been watching, if you're just tuning in for the first time, this is the best business, the most profitable business on. Oh, someone actually bought something. <laughs> most profitable is uh, not not exactly true, but uh, I just want to just. And a pick. Nine diamonds? Nine diamonds? <laughs> I take that back. Is It is for sure the most profitable business on the NationCraft server. Philly added these in because uh, I think a creeper made his way into my place and destroyed the area. It looks good as new, though, so I'm, I'm really impressed, you know? Thanks for fixing my, my joint. But it's Monday. It's Minecraft. One could say it's, you know, oh, I was going to mine those, but never mind. Uh, one could say it's Minecraft Monday. The reason we're on the vanilla textures is I've been working in the nether. Trying to work on a hub. Oh, there's some stone brick. In the texture pack, I normally use, oh, I should put this in the ender chest. The texture pack I normally use, let's turn this down so you don't have to hear this so much. B Dub's mashup pack is his nether brick is like black and it just it's not it's not fun to build with personally. Oh, a little bit of a lag there. Dump those in there. But uh, no business here either. Did uh, Philly get Philly? Philly is probably swimming. Oh, okay. You might buy. I think I I've only bought two shulkers so far. I don't want to take all of them from people, but man, that is a profitable business. Profitable. <laughs> but yeah, B Dub's mashup pack makes the Nether brick too black, so I don't want to do that. Um, we're gonna be using vanilla textures today for Jappa's Yappa's newest texture pack. The guy who does all the uh, the texturing for Mo Yang. Uh, some people like the classic feel of Minecraft, which you can still do, or you can do the default look and feel of Minecraft, <laughs> which I actually like these textures better than the the OG OG textures, which is kind of kind of different. But I've been trying to plan and creative, and it just it never works for me. I don't know how people do it. They plan and creative, and then they come here, and it just. They just they just do what they did in creative and that, that doesn't work for me. So we're gonna do this all the way around. I chopped this at first because it was an odd number, but I'm gonna keep it. Like the actual height of the portal. So I wanted to do the castle staggered pattern. If you're not whoa not know what I'm talking about, let me let me enlighten you. Um not even just all castles, but some of the buildings in the olden days you see it where they have Ooh, Discord message. Uh, kind of like this pattern on the corners. You know? Something like that. That kind of looks like it's a little bit more structurally integral. <laughs> it's not a word. Uh, structurally sound. That's That works in the uh, the actual corners of the product so ah da, 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 da. not today this is why I brought a bow Ooh, gave you a little haircut there later bitch I'm gonna take your gas too so I wouldn't mind using some end crystals oof four that's actually uh, perfect I just need some ender pearls or no, ender eyes. I need ender eyes, I think it is. Ender eyes and a gas tier and glass, and I can make the end crystals. I love using them as decorations in the nether. 
They are very, very, very explosive, but they look so cool all hovering and all that shit. So I'll try to I'll try to get some of those for the build as well. But everything is a work in progress. It's going to be difficult because I I had an idea originally over here. This is my mess. Sorry, I'll clean it up. Where I wanted to have floating a floating portal, but I didn't know how the paths would actually connect. Sorry, a little sleepy. Let me take a drink here too. Ah, refreshed. Uh, a floating portal, but it, it was it didn't make sense to do like a big floating por floating portal like this, and how the paths would actually connect to something that would be suspended. Uh, because if you have like eight different people, and the portal only has four sides, like my next suggestion was on a floating island. But the area where we have the portal, if I do a floating island, it would just make more way more sense to have it tethered. So then I try to do these like tiny little suspended islands that had very small supports below them. But I didn't have enough netherrack, and as I got bigger to make it look cooler, it just it looked dumb. It looked like it should just be connected to over there. So I'm just going to stick with these and try to come up with something a little nasally now. Try to come up with something cool and decorate this area. Very nice. I wish you could put a block. I guess you could. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to work out some things. And I will be back with you guys in a little bit. All right. Mere seconds for you. I just played like 30 games of Call of Duty. She's coming out okay, right? She's looking all right. Let's just do this for now. Because it's kind of bugging me when this is all empty. Or missing. Uh, excuse me. I'm a man. I apologize. Ooh. Uh, 40... 30 games of Call of Duty, uh, pierogies, and a nap. Two-hour nap later. It's 2 a.m. We're back. Hi. Hi. How's it going? So, working out some designs. Uh, I had something else here before, but it was this stuff. Ignore the nether sound. Hello, Mr. Piggies. I had this stuff, like, here. And I realized as I was building it, it wasn't going to match on this side. So I had to take it all down, which sucks. So now we have a new design. Ooh, you know what I just realized? One, two, three, four, five. If we do that, and then go up kind of the same style. This is just a test. Hold on. This might look pretty cool, actually. Uh, let's say here. Boop. And let's just do a layer of netherrack for demonstration, because I don't have my scaffolding. I gotta get a quartz villager. Bad. Um, hmm. Maybe we do it here, then, so we can get actually a full, a full circle in. A full square. Uh, boop. Boop. And we can maybe put slabs here, which I don't have. And we can give it maybe a quartz underbelly. Yeah, that doesn't look too bad. I don't like this part, but this is just for show anyways. We could just actually kind of mirror this as well if we wanted to hey i need supplies for this i am running low oh john did john bring me glass he didn't okay maybe he got occupied out i don't know but that looks kind of neat right i did a couple other designs as well Mm, you know what? I actually don't like that. Let's get some slabs. Sorry. Actually, I only need two. Perfect. Yeah, I like that. We could make this maybe an actual block. And connect it with the other side. Because it's going to be a two-floor deal. So I'll have two floors on each side. Or, 
not two floors on each side. It'll just have two floors, period. Oops, this does not go here. This is my problem. I'm not, I'm not doing it right. I gotta, this is why I tend to make these like grid, grid areas. So I have, when I'm doing like cardinal directions, it's just easier to reference, especially when you have to do it f three or four times. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, that was a villager. But yeah, I think next task, definitely get some wither skulls, fight a wither, and then get some banging ass villagers. That's probably going to be our next goal. Let's bring, let's just make a stack of stairs. Boop. And we'll only need a little bit of slabs, but we'll do that. Did I do this wrong? I did do this wrong. <laughs> Uh, amateur. See, this doesn't matter. We can get we can get some of this nether brick back. This doesn't need to be like this. Let's just use it as a area just to place the stairs upside down and not upside down. Uh, like this, like this, like this, like this, like this, like this, like this. Perfect. And now we do a little reference. Can I reach? That's not low enough. There we go. We should be good. Uh, this, this. I'm pretty sure. Nope. This. And. How did I fuck this up so hard? There. Why was that so difficult? What goes here? A slab? Is this the slab one? Oh, yeah, this is. Why is this so weird? Hold up. Okay. Right? Why did I do this so weird? Oh, we have four. Why is the gap four? Huh. Now we got thinking to do. If we do. Don't break me. Is this going to look okay? Please look okay. Yeah, it just doesn't look centered, which kind of bugs me. Kind of irks me a little bit. Because this is like hiding. I might have to copy. Just for the symmetry purposes. Let's take a look after I copy this. See, it doesn't in, in it invades the block differently. What the hell? My brain is broken here. Okay, this is five, one hundred percent. Let's break this because there should be a center. So we should be able to do. Yeah, I don't understand how I got <laughs> where I got. I mean, that might even look pretty cool. We're gonna do a little face there. Then we could do uh, fences, actually. Oh, that fence will not go there. Just working with you on camera. No, I like the, uh, you know what? I might do that. Cause it kind of looks like an arching bridge. Just like a little micro arching bridge. Yeah, I think I like that. So I'm going to try playing with some designs. And again, I will be back with you guys. I don't do time lapses for the small stuff because it's a lot of placing, destroying, placing, destroying, placing, destroying. The first design took like three or four attempts. And this is taking three or four attempts. So it's, just, it's not good for time lapses. I need to, I need like more of like a 70% vision when I'm doing time lapses so I know where I'm going. 
but uh, I'll be back with you guys. All right. Worked out some stuff, flipped some things, played with the flinger bonger, added the whippersnapper, and now we're finally making progress on this biatch. I actually don't know if I placed this all the way around on all these sides, but we'll find out once I take a little tour. Oh, guest head. Oh, it looks so small in my hand. Look how cute his little face is. Uh, I haven't seen a Ravager head ever before. I'm the only one on the server, for sure, that has a Ravager head. So I think I'm going to keep that because it's a it's a hot commodity. So this is the design. Actually, we could throw some stone stairs here. Let's see if we can play with this a little bit on uh, camera. My pick is destroyed, almost. My food is ever so low, so we're going to have to do a restock shortly here. Uh, maybe we'll keep that stair upside down, or that way. And we'll do this. Pew! We need quartz. That's probably what I'm going to do after this, is just go get some villager quartz. <laughs> some stonemasons, there we go. Just to, just to trade with myself so we can actually have some quartz to pay for. Because we do have quite a bit of emeralds. And I want to use more quartz in this area. Like, we could cheap out a little bit here, actually. Now that I'm thinking of it. Save. Save where you can, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so this is a path where someone connect. This. So on the bottom floor, we'll have eight paths so far. Which isn't too bad. Oh, actually, technically, these could be pathways, too, if you wanted I think maybe we'll reserve these for... No, because they won't always be in that direction. Okay, so we got 12. Yeah, we have 12 paths along the bottom, which is pretty good. Uh, shopping district in the center. I don't know where the stronghold is. So if someone wants to link that, I would appreciate that. Uh, but if you just come to the... Anyone who's watching this video who's part of the server, um, you could just link it up. Any of your portals, feel free. Just maybe come over with a sign and just... Claim which uh, which way you want for your nether uh, Philly. If you want to, you can take the center lane, or you can take this one, or you can take that one. It's it, it really doesn't matter. That portal leads to actual spawn, I think. So, but yeah. I, oh, oh, I didn't mention this. I uh, I lowered this because as I was building up top here, it wasn't making much sense. Let me come up here to explain to you guys. Uh, so I had it, I think, right here. And I had this weird path where it went like up a slab. And then it was, I don't know, it just didn't look nice. So it wasn't even with this. But now that we have this, we could be even with this. And I'd love to just run quartz, I think, along here. I think that would look a very nice. Just use slabs for now. Yeah, I do like that. Uh, and then maybe we could just do... I don't know what that... Update, I guess? Some some sort of winder, windows... <laughs> some sort of windows information. Notification on information. Uh, and then we could do... Maybe just follow suit. And... Ooh. This might be interesting. Ooh. I don't know how I'm going to do this area. Well, that doesn't look too bad. Maybe I just figured it out. Uh, and then maybe we'll do stairs here, actually. Well, then those will hide the quartz. Oh, see ya. I'm alone on the server. Goodbye, everybody. Uh, boop. 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 We can actually save quartz if we do it this way, too. Huh? That corner looks weird, though. So we'd probably switch this to a solid stone brick. Man, but that cod, it's addicting. But boy, is it ever. Let's try that on both sides and see how we like it. I just can't get enough. I'm itching to play right now. I think I might go play a little bit of free-for-all. The first free-for-all game I ever played, I fucking won. No big deal. No big deal. I will take some of those blocks back. Please and thank you. Not too shabby. We could switch up 
maybe these and do walls. No, I don't like that. It, it's too like f too harsh of a change. Maybe if we do stone brick. Man, I they really need to add stone walls. That is driving me nuts. Oops. Let's just try two of these. It's okay. Nether fence gates would be nice too. <laughs> just asking for everything. But that's not too bad. I just I don't like stone all the way across because we haven't used stone too much other than in the floor and i'm not even going to keep this floor i don't think uh when john drops off the uh glass or if he does he doesn't, he doesn't need to it's just uh just would help out anyone watching this i'll take donations i need uh quartz is the biggest donation right now uh, another brick would be nice but that's cool i can always just smelt some or go mine some off one of the fortresses uh, I'll, I, I mined some on the fortress over there, and I noticed we have a little, little baby. I noticed we had, like, a flat area for hunting withers for now. I did not affect that at all. I just dug some of the areas that needed to be actually flattened a little bit more, or, uh, like, pillars. So it doesn't, it doesn't really matter too much. But yeah, people could technically start linking their portals. These will be tiny, tiny, tiny rooms, and I don't know how I'll connect to the second floor just yet. Hello. Let's see if we can get another head. Don't touch my build. Head? No, gas tears though. Oh yeah, and I want to build with some end crystals possibly. But uh, I don't have an ender pearls. Because again, I don't know where the stronghold is. We could have an ender ender for all I know. <laughs> I doubt we do. But anyways, that's going to have to do it for this Minecraft Monday Nomadic <laughs> Nation Craft episode hopefully you guys enjoyed it um feel free to give me suggestions on what i should do with this place because i'm uh, i'm running a little blind especially in how to get to the second floor i'm thinking maybe when we go out this way uh, we'll have stairs to go up and right but i got to keep in mind that these will have to have little cells like little rooms for each person's area and then i do kind of want to have a mailbox system which we can actually do on camera right now probably uh, let's drop off some of this material. Check me out. Check me out. Check me out. Hear me out for a minute. Uh, barrels. Check me out. And if I had a tripwire hook, I'd probably put it on the side. But that could be the mailboxes for each of the people. Ooh, maybe signs above would help too. Um, turn these all into sticks. And now I realize I don't have any wood to do any of this. Okay, never mind. <laughs> but yeah, I think a, a mailbox system is nice. So kind of if you have anything for somebody, you could... Bitch! No. Oh, I'm sorry, Philly. Oh, no. Oh, I'm getting nervous. I'm getting sweaty. I'm getting sweaty. Just hit him. Head? Uh, Philly, also, your path has holes everywhere. Like, look at this. Look at this. Before I go, I almost died today. Did someone fix it? This No. Is it this one? This one. Look at that. I almost missed it. I almost fell right now. What a weird scaffolding going on over there. What the hell is this? Huh? You trying to kill someone? Because that's how you're going to kill someone. But that's, yes, that's going to have to do it for uh, today's episode. Uh, make sure to check me out next Monday where there will also be another video of this uh, thing server <laughs> outro sorry my strong suit but thank you for watching and uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode bye bye <laughs>